So in this video, we are going to see how we can create our own MIT App Inventor extension. Okay. So first of all, we need to use here one platform. This is the online platform called Natron. Okay. Using this, we can build the extension. Okay. So you just need to Nitron IDE. As you can see, ide.nitron.com. So you can see this is the dashboard and we are going to create one extension. So let's suppose uh, create an extension that can add two values. So how we can create it? It's just like a calculator extension app. So you don't need to code uh, in the block section. It's a basic extension, but let's see how we can build that extension, right? Then we can build a lot more extension. So let's click on the create new project. Okay. Project name always should start from the capital. Okay. So suppose new calculator okay the package name should be always like the your app name and then dot com so suppose new calculator dot com like this you can you need to put icon url so you can put any icon url okay i don't have any url right now so i'll just leave it as it is and the description is like calculator app okay you can just put any uh, other description here and let's click on the continue wait some seconds and it's done okay now as you can see there are a lot of coding like see this is the java code but i don't know much about java so how can i build my own extension it's easy we just need to use your deep seek so you can see this is the deep seek chat.deepseek.com now i'm gonna go to here i'm gonna just copy whole code and just control c go to dc deep seek and here just need to say here create app inventor extension that can do addition of two values two values okay given by user okay here is the code completed without any error you given by the user you need to complete the code by adding new function okay that take two input values from the addition and return the result okay below this is the complete code so let's wait some second and that will give you the code. Now let's copy this. Just copy. Go to the ID again. Just control A, command A and just paste it. Done. Now let's click on the save button. Save it. Done. Now let's click on the compile extension. As you can see at this one, just click on compile extension. Project saved and it's compiling. Let's see the error. No, there's no error. And you can see this is we have AIX file. Okay. Go to the app inventor. Let's click on new project. Cal app okay and we are going to use that extension okay so scroll down and you will see the extension option in that option we need to click on import extension click on choose file and we have the new calculator.aix just click on it and import it now we have imported our own extension in app inventor and just drag and drop that extension like this as you can see here this extension doesn't have the image okay that's why it's like this so we can upload the icon image url okay i'm going to use one button here I'm going to use here to text box like this. Okay, like this. And whenever I click on that button, so I need to result in that label. Okay, let's go to the block. Click on that extension. And as you can see here, we have everything here, right? So whenever, what we need to do here, I'm going to just use here the label. So set label dot text like this and click on that extension. And as you can see here, this we need to call that method. And as you can see here, call calculator. Add, okay, we are calling the addition here, value 1 and value 2. So we are going to pass the value 1 and 2 from the text box 1.text. As you can see here, this one from here and just paste it and value 2 like this. Okay, now we just need to click on the screen in this, uh, no, on the button pick. Okay, we are going to call this and this, as you can see here, once we click on the button, so that will, that extension, okay, that method will get the value from text box 1 and text box 2 and that will do the addition part because we already have done the code for addition like the plus icon and everything in that extension code okay and that will return the value in the label that's it that's really really amazing okay i hope now you can see okay so let's put 53 and 7 and then click on that button you can see 60 fantastic so we created one extension that do the addition now, we all know that it's a basic code, basic extension, but we know that how to build our own extension, right? That's the main thing. So, this is all about it. So, if you have any doubt, you can ask me in the comment. 